Hello and welcome to the SUMIF function with Miriam. The SUMIF function can be used when you require Excel to sum cells from one column based on criteria in another. For example, in cell G2 we would like the salary total for all those who work in the office department. In column B we have the various departments listed. In column C we have the corresponding salaries. We would like Excel to extract all those from the office department in column B and total the corresponding salaries. We will use the SUMIF function to obtain this. We start the SUMIF function with equals. All formulas within the Excel program begin with the equal sign. So it's equals SUMIF. Open brackets and B2 full colon to B26. Comma. Because office is a word, we must use the quotations. Open quotes and type office. Close the quotes and insert a comma. Then the corresponding salary column is C2 to C26. Close brackets. This formula translated means equal to sum if, sum if the column range from B2 to B26 has the word office. Then go to cell C2 to C26 cell range and sum. Enter. And as you can see, Excel returns the correct total. We will do it again for transport. We would like Excel to sum if column B has the word transport and sum the corresponding transport salaries in the cell range C2 to C26. Equals sum if open brackets b2 to b26 comma open quotes transport close quotes comma go to cell range c2 to c26 close brackets so the formula should read equal sum if open parenthesis b2 full colon b26 comma open quotes, transport, close quotes, comma, C2, full colon, to C26, close brackets, and enter. And again, you will see that Excel inserts the correct salary total for all those working in the transport department. And again, for the kitchen, equals sum if, open brackets, the cell range B2 to B26, comma, open quotes, kitchen, close quotes, comma, C2, full colon, to C26, close brackets, and enter. And once again, for the administration, equals sum, if, open brackets, B2, full colon, to B26, comma, open quotes, administration. Close quotes, comma, then go to the cell range C2 to C26, close brackets, and enter. The number of personnel, we can also use the count if function to find the number of personnel in any department. It's a similar formula with one less perimeter. If you have watched my earlier video on the count if, you already know how to do this. I will do it once again equals count if open brackets the cell range from B2 to B26 is office open quotes close quotes and then close the bracket and again it returns 5 we will do the count if once again, for the transport department, equals count if, open brackets, the cell range B2, full colon to B26, is transport. And again for the kitchen, equals, ugh, equals count if, open brackets, B2, full colon to B26, 
This time, it's kitchen. Close bracket. And one last time for administration. Equals. Count if. Open brackets. B2. Full column to B26. Comma. Open quotes. Administration. Close quotes. Close brackets. And enter. Thank you for watching the SUMIF function and the COUNTIF function recap with Miriam step by step.